Ah, feel that energy. Come on, soak it up. Mm, so good. Welcome back, everybody. So there is a ton of power right now coming from the sun all over me here. And I'm gonna show you how to capture that power and put it into this Ego battery. The good thing is it will not require an engineering degree. They've got this thing totally figured out. Once you get the power into here, I'll show you the sort of things you can do with it. So you're probably thinking to yourself, Andrew, how did you possibly power a microwave, a circuit or saw, a welder, and a hot tub? Yep, I did that with this Ego battery right here. Well, the answer is this. This is the Ego Nexus power station. And really simply think of this as a battery power generator that you can power any appliance around your house with. Now the Ego Nexus power station basically works in two modes. The first mode is charging mode. And when the power station's in charging mode, it's basically taking power into the unit and pushing that power into the batteries and charging those batteries. That's mode one. We'll get back to that in a minute. Now mode two is inverter mode. And in this mode, you're taking all that power that's been stored in those Ego batteries and making it available so that you can power any household appliance. So now that we have our head wrapped around about how this Ego Nexus station works in those two modes, charging mode and powering mode, we have to revisit the charging mode because this is where the real exciting stuff is happening. So obviously you can charge the power station using a regular outlet right here. Nothing special right there. This will charge those batteries. Nothing special. Here's the special stuff. This is the brand new Ego Solar Charging Adapter. This lets you charge those batteries using the sun. So let me show you how easy it is to turn all that sun power into Ego battery power. Come on in. So the secret to this is this right here. This is brand new. This is the Ego Solar Charging Adapter, which was just released. And what this does is it allows you to take power from your solar panel. It goes through the adapter here and then plugs into the Ego Nexus power station. So I told you this does not take an engineering degree to set up. Let me show you what I mean. So I've got here a Renogy 100 watt panel. You can see the ratings for the panel are right on the back there. This is one of the approved panels by Ego. Let me show you how to plug in the panel. This is really easy because they're polarized. You can see you can't get this wrong. So you just take these connectors and plug them in like that. That's one. And here's the second one. And you plug it in. So next, take your connector from your solar panel and plug it into your solar charging adapter. Really easy, just like that. So next you take the output from the Ego Solar Charging Adapter and plug it into the back of the Ego Nexus power station. Now we're making power! Ooh, it's a little cloudy up there. So we're probably not making power today, but the good news, the other day, it was beautifully sunny and this thing was doing its job. Check it out. So fortunately, Mother Nature cooperated with me on a few days and gave me some really nice sunny days. And I was able to charge this Ego Nexus power station using this brand new Ego Solar Charger Adapter. This is like the secret sauce here. So basically the results from those tests on average was I was able to charge two 56 volt, five amp hour batteries over the course of a day, totaling 560 watt hours. Now to give you an idea of how much power that is, you could basically run a TV and an LED light bulb for about five hours uh, from that amount of charge. That's pretty cool, right? So I know I talked about a lot of pieces and components today. Don't worry because everything I talked about will be listed down below in the comments. All right, guys, it is time for the wrap up. Let's start by talking about the Ego Nexus power station. First off, this thing is so handy to have around. It's great for power emergencies. It's great for off-grid power, camping, anything like that. In fact, you're gonna find more uses for it than you can even think of right now. It's amazing. Now, the other thing I like about this is it's safe to use. There's no exhaust, easy to start, no maintenance. It's really convenient that way. And the batteries are so versatile because they can be used on your yard tools. 
Now I do love the fact that they came out with a way to charge this thing with solar panels. Do I think it's the only way you're gonna ever charge these batteries? No, but it does give you some flexibility. So the last thing we need to talk about is cost of this Ego solar charger adapter. And I understand it's gonna be about 150 bucks. So if you've already got a power station, you've already got Ego batteries, you gotta get yourself one of these. So if you wanna learn more about this Ego power station, there's a video right there that you're not gonna wanna miss. I'll see you over there.